20 minutes shaving my head thinking that you were watching and you know what <laughs> I forgot to start the fucking stream forgot to start the recording anyway right so <laughs> anyway <coughs> now I'm bald with a, not a hair on my head a few hairs on my chin 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 but not a hair on my head oh god damn it you know mm. so you, you miss me you miss me shaving my head you miss me shaving my head you miss me rubbing beard and face wash beard and face wash no I didn't put no, not beard and face wash um, I can't even see and I've not got my glasses on um, you, miss, you miss me rubbing um, face and stubble mo moisturiser by King C. Gillette right nice stuff anyway you know, we'll rub a wee bit of that and uh, yeah, do you know what? I think it's been a success. Look at my bald bonnet, my curved, beautiful, smooth fucking head. As I was saying when I was talking, when the camera was on, <laughs> I remember going to France in my twenties, twenty twenty one, and some Belgian guys I met there were really talking some Belgian guys I met there came and they shaved their heads, right? But they didn't wear a hat, right? Now, I had hair back then. I had beautiful golden blonde locks with golden blonde highlights, right? And people used to say, how did you get your hair out? What, what dye did you use? And I would say, it's natural, and they wouldn't believe it. But my hair used to be light brown with blonde highlights simply down by just walking about in the sun. I had beautiful blonde streaks through my hair just by walking about in the sun and people wouldn't believe that I didn't dye my hair. And then when I started to go grey when I was 25, <laughs> so 20, I had beautiful brown hair with blonde highlights, natural highlights. The girls loved me and the girls' mums loved me and the girls grandmoms loved me it was fantastic i could get off with anybody in france at that time even with my accent <laughs> it was a beautiful period of my life by the time i was 25 yeah only the grandmoms wanted me because my hair was gray <laughs> i've been gray since starting to turn gray since i was 21 20 beautiful brown hair with blonde highlights. By the time I was 22, yeah, beautiful brown hair with blonde highlights and lots of grey in it. By the time I was 25, beautiful brown hair with grey highlights. <laughs> <coughs> oh my God, yeah, yeah. yeah but, but you know, I, I still want my fucking end away, you know what I mean? Because it's not always about what you look like. Sometimes it's just about what you've got to say and, you know, your, your presence in, in the world, you know what I mean? You've got to be yourself. You've got to talk about who you are and what you want from life and, you know, people will respond to that. You know what I mean? They don't always respond kindly, but, you know, enough of them do for you to get on, especially if you're young. Youth has got a lot going for it. I've got to say that, you know, yeah. Youth has got a lot go going for it. Not a lot of fucking sense or <laughs> intelligence or understanding of the world. That comes with fucking maturity. Uh, but maturity also comes with wrinkled skin and grey hair, which is a bit of a fucking back burner for, you know, getting, getting it on with, you know, young women. <laughs> Who, wait for it, we all want young women, not children. I'm not a fucking pervert, right? I'm not fucking feed into that fucking Republican 
bullshit in America. I'm not looking for a child. I don't want to fucking get off with a 17 year old. I'm looking for like a 25 to 30 year old. They are the fucking best. Closer to 25 is better, but no. Being 30 doesn't mean you're, you're past it. Just means um, you're my second choice. Anyway, <laughs> I'm 60. I'm sure I'm not Andy's choice. No, far be it from me to tell you what woman want, but I'm pretty sure it's not a 60 year old man who's not a billionaire. Now, if my name was Elon Musk, women wouldn't care what I looked like. They would just be seeing dollar things, you know what I mean? And uh, be very unhappy in the bedroom, but very happy when they went to the bank and went shopping. Um, and maybe that's all women want at that age is, uh, you know, yeah, some money in the bank and they're able to shop anywhere and buy anything they want. And then, you know, complain about how bad the sex is when they get home. You know what I mean? And tell their hubby, you know, one, you know, how much they've enjoyed the day shopping and uh, how much they were disappointed with, you know, the night in the bedroom because oh, it's Eon. Oh, you, you can't, you still can't get it up. You've been to space for fuck's sake. Didn't that help you? No, it didn't. Yeah. Anyway. <laughs> mm. And Bozos's heart <laughs> didn't help him get it up either. Anyway, let's have a look. <coughs> so I've um, shaved my head. I'm probably going to have to start wearing the hat. What do you think? It, that looks good, actually. That looks. I, I like that one. I'm, I'm, I think I might start wearing that. That's good. That's a nice hat. I like that. Right, we'll keep that one. That's a that's a positive. But this Star Wars. Star Wars hat. That's good as well. I kind of like that. That that suits me. Right. I'll keep that too. What about that? Um, oh my god. Yeah. The polka dot look doesn't really suit me, I don't think. And what about this one? The jungle hat? No, anyway. Um, I'll use that for like bad weather when it's raining so I don't get my, my good hats wet. And uh, what about this one? Look at that. Jungle warfare. That isn't too bad. I kind of like that one. I kind of like that. That that was that was only a four pound hat, wasn't it? Yeah, I, I think what three ninety nine. I think I paid for that, and that was pretty good. I got that other one was three eighty. The Star Wars one was a quid. I got the Star Wars one for a quid. I love that a quid. Uh, this one I think was, yeah, I think that was two. I think that was two quid as well. I got that one ninety nine. Yeah, I think I got that one ninety nine. It's double wind as well. It's got uh, another liner, another lining. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So I, I like I like that one. I'm kind of taken with that. Kind of makes me kind of uh, out back. You know what I mean? Australian. Ori cover. <laughs> Yeah, right, cover. <laughs> is that is that an Australian? I don't know if that's an Australian. It's probably not an Australian accent. <laughs> but I kind of like that hat. I like. I kind of like this. This is good. You know, I like this. Oh yeah. Is it no? It's good. You're doing it up at the back and doing it at the front. In it. That's that's how you wear these hats. Wait, me just bash my brains in at the front. Yeah. So yeah. You, you, it's quite good in the front, huh? Yeah, it's quite good in it. So, how huh? do that? Right, there we go. Uh, I think. Yeah. Good day. Good day, mate. Good day, mate. All right, come on. Uh, so, yeah, I think I found the hat for the, the summer. I think it's going to be this one. So, uh, sign your fucking van, motherfuckers, and uh, 
wherever they are, what you're doing, I hope it's all going well for you, and uh, yeah, fantastic, fantabitose. We are traveling the world, so jump on the drive. idea who this guy is. Apparently he calls himself Davidas. Da Davidas. <laughs> this is the same guy but um, many many years later he obviously hasn't shaved his head or put a hat on. <laughs> he, he obviously hasn't shaved his head or put a hat on.
Music. Yeah, you got it. That's me. You. Thank you. We're so fly on through the sky. No? Yeah, I've never if heard it. If you don't know it, you never heard it? I'm from a different country, so I'm familiar with most American music, you know? Uh, Fucking Jimi Hendrix. Fly on through the sky. Yeah, that same... Fly on my sweet angel, fly on to the sky.
it's uh, you see, they didn't pay anything for the tickets, so it's, they can't <laughs> complain, okay? That's awesome. So. So you see, that's what I'm trying to look, to learn. I see angel, sky, angel, and...
Okay, I was saying something there and my microphone went out. Right. America, you got some fat woman, right? I'm not talking fat fat, I'm talking about fat. You women are fat and I want to fat them, you know what I mean? Oh, they are so fatable, you know what I mean? Some, so many fatable women in America, oh. See what I'm saying? Look at all these fat women, man. Oh, they are so fat. Yeah, they, they are fatable. You know what I mean? They are definitely fatable. I would fat them. I would, I would definitely fat them. <laughs> Okay guys, that's me, I'm done. Uh, I, I just put a video on because I was shaving my head and I thought people might want to see that shit. Anyway, um, I'm sorry for messing up the no, microphone stuff at the beginning, the middle and the end. It's, it's what I do, but look at that nice fat woman. Ain't she fat? Ain't she fat? Look at her, she's fat. Ain't I don't. I know, right? Right, fat woman. Yeah, I love it. I would fat them all day long. I would, all day would. Anyway, sons of are, wherever you are, whatever you're doing, I hope it's all going well for you. And I'll catch you anon when I get back to streaming games and shit. Um, I'm just, I've just not been in yet. I just been. T this went for third year now of fucking the Lorgy, and um. I'm kind of burnt out. I'm burnt out with everything. I'm, I end up watching mostly cat fucking videos at the moment. And uh, washing the queen in the house and doing laundry and fucking gardening and sh Well, I say garden, but I haven't gardened. I haven't gardened the front garden for a while. It's fucking for a weeks. 
it's it's a it's like a two three day job to fucking weed that fucking thing, and I just don't have. But the the weather's coming in now, the sun's shining, you know. And uh, maybe I will get back into gardening and sorting my garden, my front garden. But it's just you know, it's like god damn. Do I even have the motivation to get out of my bed in the morning and do it? I don't. I just don't at the moment. I don't have any motivation to get up and do it. And other than turn my computer, well, my computer's on all night anyway. I just wake up and change, change screens and see what's going. Kind of got a couple of screens, as you know, and I just swap to one that's showing me cat videos and dog videos and know people doing stupid shit you know what I mean and stuff like that and I, once I get into that I, f I forget all about streaming I just sit there watching you know car crashes and cat videos and dog videos and people videos and stupid people jumping after things and falling and you know all that stuff you, you know what I'm talking about you know? um, but anyway right that's me trying to fucking bar season on <laughs> whatever you are we're doing all those are going well for you and um hope the luggies and luggy hasn't got to you and uh we see each other on the other side of this thing. Shrangy fucking va, motherfuckers.